So we found a bumblebee, the cold bumblebee in the winter inside of a plant. It was cold. We heat it up and give it some honey. And now it eats the honey with the mouth. It has a tongue. It's licking, licking the honey from the spoon. And then it's going to go back to the nest and tell all of its brothers and sisters about the adventure. How a strange people catch it, heat it up and give it honey. Bumblebee is not biting. Some people think the bumblebees are biting, but the bumblebees they are not biting. Maybe in some tropical place the bumblebee bite, but in the usual places the bumblebees do not bite. Unlike bees. They live in the nest of maybe 30, maybe 50, 10, 15 brothers and sisters. And they collect honey and make, uh, I think they make a solid honey, they make like a caramel honey, not, not like liquid honey, for storage purposes. Usually they make them in the ground, I think. Let's see, let's try to zoom in on the on the on the mouth. Here is the mouth. Here it comes out of a little tube. They have a little tongue. Little tongue they have. It's probably going to try to eat one drop of it. Also, it's not a bee. No, the bee is eating like one drop. This one can eat probably three drops at least of liquid sugary nectar. This is not, not so liquid, but it's still hungry. Hungry, hungry bumblebee. Ia, ia, o. Oh. There should be a children's song about the hungry bumblebee. Bzz. Bzz. Okay, the bumblebee escaped. Now there is no bumblebee. There's the honey left. Bumblebee went to the nest. And now it's gonna celebrate a little drop of honey that it got. Maybe it's gonna share the honey with other bumblebees. By the way, this is a natural forest honey, it's not the farmland honey that is might be might be diluted. Also, the honey of the today, the cheap one, you can be sure it's diluted with sugar and fr fructose and glucose. The more expensive honey, it can be also diluted, but you taste it. When you know the good honey, once you try the honey from the beekeeper then you know the taste how it tastes it doesn't taste like anything like the cheap honey from the supermarket this is the taste by which you can know it has a little bit like a waxy taste there is more plant flavors it's not uniform flavor like in the in the shop in, if the honey has a uniform flavor you can only taste one plant okay that is possible if the honey is collected like from a large tree, the, the bees. But if you taste the uniform taste of the honey from the shop, then this honey is probably mixed with some glucose or sugar. That's how they do it. They just mix sugar water, give it to the bees, and the bees, they, they process it and mix it with the honey. They don't even have to mix it after the, after the fact. So that's a little bit of cheating from the bad beekeepers. Okay. Good luck. Like the bumblebee, the bumblebee, all the hungry bumblebee. Try to find the good honey for the bumblebee. Bye bye.